Hi, it's Daiki again. I'm a Japanese living in Finland. In this vlog, I will show you how it's like to fly from Japan to Finland with Japan Airlines during pandemic. I went back to Japan for one month and while I was there, I made some videos such as flying from Finland to Japan during pandemic and the hotel quarantine in Tokyo. So if you're interested, please watch those videos as well. The airport staff of Japan Airlines was supporting each passenger to check in and drop off luggages. They were also helpful and polite. I arrived at the airport quite early since I wanted to show you one cool area of Tokyo International Airport. There are a variety of restaurants built in a traditional Japanese style. Unfortunately, most of the places are closed because of this situation. Since I had some Japanese coins left and wanted to use them all, I dropped by this cafe. I ordered matcha with small refreshments since I thought I should have something very Japanese before leaving. I went through the security control and walked through the quiet airport to the gate. There were only three passengers on the Finnian flight from Finland to Japan, but this time there were 12 other passengers. While waiting for the plane taking off, I filmed some videos. Then one of the cabin crews came and asked me if I was able to film what I wanted. We had some conversations and then she wished me a good flight. After the captain turned off the seatbelt sign, the chief parser came to greet me. She started a small talk by asking me what I do in Finland and how the pandemic situation there. Since the number of passengers are limited, it seems that they focus on a close communication with each passenger, which is actually nice. Then they brought me dinner. Wow, this looks good, doesn't it? They had two options, sweet and sour simmered chicken served with Japanese style pilaf or Thai style beef curry served with steamed rice. I chose a chicken one. As a dessert, I got my favorite ice cream brand, Hagen Dutt ice cream. All the dishes were tasty. It was probably the best economy class meal I've ever had. After eating, they turned off the in-flight lights. Some other passengers were sleeping, but I wasn't sleepy at all because it was still around noon in Japan time. I edited videos and then watched one movie, Vicky Cristina Barcelona. 
I hope we get vaccinated as soon as possible and get to travel around cool places abroad like Barcelona. The washroom was clean and surprisingly, it had an electric bidet function as well. I tried to sleep but wasn't able to, so watched some random series, read an in-flight magazine and enjoyed watching a view. Around 90 minutes before landing, they served breakfast. So the menu includes chicken and vegetable cream soup, ratatouille, stone baked bread and pineapple jelly. I was fully satisfied with it. I was actually excited to try this because I knew Japan Airlines collaborates with Soup Sok Tokyo, a popular soup restaurant chain in Japan, to create a new breakfast menu on international flights. We are approaching to Helsinki Vanta Airport. We are flying into clouds and, as it was told, the weather in Helsinki was cloudy and chilly. We landed in Helsinki Vanta Airport. It was a pleasant flight. It felt really nice to be back in Finland and I love to breathe in the fresh air when I come back to Finland from other countries. Unlike the long, strict process at the airport in Tokyo, it took only 15 minutes in Helsinki airport to go through security control and the check of the negative certificate. So I just went through the security control, it was really quick and smooth, unlike Japanese security control. And I picked up my luggage and now I'm going home, my friend is here to pick me up. A friend of mine picked me up and then I got home. Okay, I just got home. Uh, yeah, it was a long flight, but uh, I'm gonna take a shower and get some rest. The one month holiday in Japan went by quickly. And now I'm going back to work already tomorrow. But yeah, I'm excited to be here again. Okay, let's make our summer. Fabulous. See you.